Hey Pisces, welcome. Welcome you Pisces. This is the sixth week of the year 2020. And this is the first week of February Pisces. I love you guys. I hope you're having a good week. All right, Pisces, let's go, let's go, let's go. I am so tired. I'm going to really rest this week. I've been going and going at it. Pisces, something came out, Pisces. Ooh, Pisces, the end of a cycle. Wow, this is so beautiful, Pisces. This is a lot of weeks, so this is good. And it's the end of a cycle, okay, Pisces, so... That's your middle, your middle deal. The end of a Pis uh, end of a cycle. Whatever there was, Pisces, is the end of a cycle. You need to find some strength to deal with this situation, whatever that was happening and transpiring. A cyclist ending for you, Pisces. Uh, okay, some of you were hoping for your wishes and dreams to come true. It's kind of in the reserve. I see you are not moving you're not thinking to move i see you're in limbo i see you're seeing the truth of a situation what has happened and what has transpired and i see you have strong foundation now okay you have strong foundation with a situation now let's see what's in your foundation i see you have the energy of the magician and I see you have no regrets with a situation that has transpired. So there we go. You're seeing the truth about the scorpion for some of you. In your foundation, you have the magician, an air sign, and you have the six of cups. You have no regret. You found out what has transpired. Hmm, you have no regrets, okay? So I see a cycle finish, is finished. Um, whatever the issue is and the situation was like you have no regrets you're letting it go you're moving on and you're thinking it's cool you know all right Pisces a cycle is over Monday it's a little bit under the weather Tuesday the you know it could be your wishes and dreams is coming true but we're going to be seeing how it's gonna affect each and every person Wednesday I see you're kind of in limbo you don't know if you should go forward or or but I see the truth is coming out about a situation at your work or a situation you're dealing with. So let's see what is coming up for you guys. So I see you have some regrets, Pisces. Whatever is transpired, you have some regrets. You have some regrets. You're dealing with an issue. You have some regrets. And it has to do with your relationship. Regrets if you're seeing a cancer, you're having some regrets. But you are now success you're going to be successfully overcoming this so let's say that you had a quarrel or that sort of a thing it's going to be okay all right um it was as if you um it was kind of hard maybe you divorced maybe you had a relationship you divorce um if you were dealing with a cancer i see you had some issue but you're going to be overcoming the situation because the energy of the sun is there okay all right so i see you had some situation dealing with friends some friends okay i see issues dealing with some friends and you were collaborating with some friends to do something and i see um it's as if communication between you and friends um isn't so clear or communication at the work floor isn't so clear so whatever is that that is going on I see you kind of um, communicating and letting people know exactly where to stand and how it's as if you Pisces are like some of you Pisces are going to be reconnecting with a friend that is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn or you're communicating to a scorpion to say hey you know shape up Wheel of Fortune is coming in for you. You're moving forward, which is very good. The Wheel of Fortune is bringing you moving forward. Money is going to be coming in for you. All right, so this is good. Some of you could be leaving an Aquarius behind and moving forward, and the money is going to be coming in. Energy of the Empress is here. So um, whatever is transpiring, I see 
um, the, the, the wheel of fortune is going to be moving you in a forward direction in a very, very, very positive, positive um, way. Okay. You're seeing the truth. What are you seeing? The truth. Ooh, double, double whammy. Double, double whammy, my um, Pisces. So um, the portals are going to be open. Double whammy. Go check out the the healing reading double double whammy you have twice the two of swords twice the two of pentacles so i see you you see the truth about something and you need to make a decision over a deceptive play that was made and again i forget i forget all right okay so you're seeing the truth about some deceptiveness um deceptive play that has made I see that there is a conflicts there is conflicts at your work or conflicts um at your work or over a house or conflicts with a child conflicts about a child and i see justice come down on this so obviously i see conflicts with you and your partner about a new house conflicts uh, um because this is conflicts in a corporation institute see a huge conflicts and i see justice came down and i see they're going to be offering you um love okay I see people coming at you like screaming like there are people coming at you screaming and you're standing your grounds and there is someone who is an Aquarian Gemini or Libran but I see um, you know more opportunities are going to be coming and I see that some of you there could be a situation that you're dealing with someone who's a scorpion and whatever is transpiring is that you or standing your grounds with this person okay you're standing your grounds with this person because you kind of find out what has transpires definitely a scorpion here it is you're dealing with an older scorpion man it could be yourself but it could be an older scorpion man um, that you're having some issues with a scorpion and the knight of wands that you're having some issues with whoever these two people has I see you're trying to find inner strength to deal with these two people whoever these people are you're definitely trying to find in a, in a strength to deal with these two people. They're old people. They're like 50 years and older. One is a scorpion and one is an, a Leo. And I see you're trying to find in a strength to deal with these people. But you're going to be overcoming this. And you're overcoming a situation that was going on. A cycle is over and, and your wishes and dreams are definitely going to be coming true. There is no question. So it's twice the wishes and dream is going to be coming in and some good news is on its way to you okay so it's a beautiful beautiful week pisces um an extremely beautiful week to you pisces because whatever that was happening and transpiring um there was there was a situation that has to do with family a family situation that was taking place and this family situation um and friendship some of you could have had friendship with a taurus virgo or a capricorn whatever there was with this friendship because it's definitely a friendship it's someone you have known in past lifetime um it is a friendship you wanted to collaborate with this person and i see you're communicating this so um some of you you could have lost the friendship of a taurus virgo or a capricorn person And I see you're going to be um, connecting with this person. You're going to be finding them connecting with this person, okay? Some of you were having issues with your marriage. You had like a quarrel or a conflict between you and your partner. I see you're going to be very successful over this, okay? Um, when it comes to your materialistic things, I see you're going to be gaining. Pisces, you're going to be gaining because the Wheel of Fortune is here for you. Pisces, this week is a very lucky week for you, Pisces. You have your wishes and dreams coming true twice. Um, there was some deceptiveness with a um some of you at, at, at a legal situation, and there was some deceptiveness. Some of you were dealing with an uh uh a, a Libran, and there was some deceptiveness with a Libran with um it could be with some money 
but um, there was some deceptiveness with a Libra and this comes out like twice. Some of you had an Aquarius and there was also some deceptiveness with this Aquarius and it has to do with uh, they have deceived a Capricorn a lot of money. Okay, and it's as if you are going to be finding out, uh, but I see justice came down on them. I see justice came down on them. And I see um, if you're having conflicts with a Leo, I see this Leo is going to go to jail. I see an apology is going to be coming in to you. So if you have an issue with a Leo, I see this Leo is going to go to jail and a, an apology is going to be coming in to you. You ladies, I see you, you ladies are dealing with a scorpion lady and I see this lady and our scorpion husband. 50 years and older you're going to be um you're going to be you 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 were dealing with these people and it was just so they and an Aries Leo and Sagittarius have brought you in some real deceptive and I see you're trying to find the strength and my card deck my card deck isn't um the right one but I'm just just going to use this this card deck okay um to see because there's some there's some deceptiveness at play okay and it has to do with a scorpion man and a scorpion woman and um an aries leo or a sagittarius so it has to do with a scorpion man and a scorpion woman and an aries leo or a sagittarius okay um it is going to be a beautiful week for you pisces there is no question your week is that a cycle is now ended whatever the issue and the situation is a cycle is now ended and what you're doing is that you're going to be overcoming so twice you have the energy of uh, whoo um um yes to go ahead with something and a cycle and a cycle okay and your wishes and dream are going to be coming true okay let me see what is this deceptiveness seven of swords two of swords seven of swords two of pentacles seven of swords two of swords two of pentacle what is this for the pisces okay so a friend in a government institute your organization you're successful over them okay so whatever that was transpiring some deceptiveness in a government institutes your organization if you having issues with a friend at work because this is a friend in a government in an organization institutes you you're very successful over them whatever the lies and deceptiveness was uh, i see you're overcoming this because it was deceptiveness with a liberal in a corporation institute it could be a legal situation this person could have been your friend that has done some deceptive thing so lies and deception is here lies and deception is here and uh, it has to do with an aquarian um a base um 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 a libran that they stole something from a capricorn okay and you are going to be finding this out lies and deception some of you are dealing with a pisces or if a cancer you women are dealing with a scorpion or a cancer man i see you know, you Pisces are going to be overcoming some real deceptiveness that has transpired. And I saw that um, some of you could have had an accident um, with a Libran and they tried to cheat you out of some money. But I see justice is going to relook at the situation and they're going to make sure that you're you're paid well because they realize that the investigation, a lot of stuff was covered up. And with the investigation, I see an ending is coming to the lies, deceitfulness, and jealousy. I see an end is coming to the lie, deceitfulness, and jealousy. And it could be coming from its karma. Whoever you're dealing with, you're dealing with some Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra people. And you have you have what it takes to 
like if you're in a company you're the manager but you have people that is sewing um sewing the 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 chair stool the the chair stool on the new uh, it's just deceptive really yeah i don't know ladies and gentlemen the world needs some help the world needs some help so here we go um here you can see it. the world really needs some help you know stay away from these people so i see an end coming to the jealous and the deceitfulness it's all um family jealousy um deceptiveness but i see a lot of love is going to be coming in for you okay so wow i don't know um pisces this is a good week for you a cycle is going to be ending you're finally going to be coming out of a cycle your wishes and dreams is going to be coming true and some good news is going to come in serenity serenity is what is called for in this week whatever is transpiring serenity is um just ser serenity is when you're sincere to the people and the situations around you okay and this is going to be um extremely good then we have the magical prior so um i think i should have it on one of my website but it's the magical prize calling up on your angels and saints and guide your angel saints and guide and they are going to be um giving you um the gifts of the gods okay and this is going to be god so positive positive energy so some good news is going to be coming in some of you are going to be overcoming a deceptiveness in an institute or organization you're going to be very successful um you pisces i see that at work if you're a manager someone is trying to um saw the stool from underneath you but they're going to be falling on their faces okay so not to worry you will find out but when you find out they're going to be already falling on their faces okay it is kind of sad humanity needs help i'm sorry ladies and gentlemen humanity really needs help sincerity is that you are moving into a time of creativity inner peace and tranquility okay peace of mind means feeling secured and knowing that you're always provided for even if your logic mind cannot um find how the challenges and conflicts could be resolved okay grace and peace of mind means that you rest that god will create a miracle for a situation okay this sort of fate is always um revealed by the universal angels so this is really really good i'm saying i love you guys i gotta go i see you next week